probably the worst round of golf I've ever had. At least if some uh, Help me! Huh? Oh, over here! Jesse, down, where'd you go? Oh, down sorry. Down the stairs! Uh, um, so that was not very fun today. <laughs> oh, um, you didn't have fun? Sorry. No, I didn't have fun. Help me! Uh, aren't you at all concerned? Can't you read my vitals or something? Anytime I'm upset, you always ask me immediately what's wrong. But now it's oh, like um, you don't even care. Help me. <sighs> I'm trying not to snap, but you're driving me crazy, Helpy. You've been ignoring me all day long. It's like you're in your own world or something. And you know what? If if you didn't want to come to Monty Golf or hang out with me, I mean, we, we could have done something else or you, you could have just said if you had something else going on, you could have just told me. And now you're just looking at whatever you're looking at once again. Do you even care? Of course I care, Cassie. I just... Look, I'm just so busy in my own head. Like you said, I'm kind of in my own world and everything. What? Which makes sense. I mean, I'm kind of like an AI, so I'm like all, like, you know, in my own plane and of existence and everything. I got my own stuff going on, you know? Um, but speaking of, I, you know, I love you very much. I had a lot me. of fun mini golfing. It sounds like you had a lot of fun too, but, um, no, I gotta I go. I'll see you later, fun. okay? No, love I, you. No, help me. Are you kidding me? What has gotten into him? I... I understand if he didn't want to hang out, but he didn't listen to anything I said. What? I want to pick myself back up after all of this, but who am I supposed to? My best friend went missing and now suddenly wants nothing to do with me? Maybe... Maybe that's where all this started? He didn't go missing, he just wanted to... Live his own life, do his own thing. I... <sighs> Man, this year freaking sucks. I can't believe this. It was supposed to be a fresh start. It was supposed to be a good year, and now... <sighs> I just can't believe how much my life is just falling apart again. Maybe I can just hang out at the pizza plex myself. I can figure out something to do. Someone to see. Maybe Freddy or... Roxanna around. Um, I mean, I guess it's closed. Uh, maybe I could go to the arcade and hang out there? Oh, I don't know. Maybe I should just go home. <sighs> I guess before I go, I could at least get a piece of pizza or something. I mean, that sounds good. Uh, sure. Pizza, and then at least I can have something for dinner. That's not cereal or peanut butter. All right, oh. just heading oh. up here, and oh. then I bet. Oh, uh, Gregory! Hello? Hey! <laughs> oh, oh, I didn't think you were gonna be at the pizza plex tonight. No, I'm actually not supposed to. I'm actually really running very, very late. Um, how, what? How, what are you up to? <laughs> well, I was golfing with uh, Helpy, but um, he oh. scurried off. Apparently, he had somewhere to be. Uh. Wait, help you? Um, somewhere to be? Yeah, uh, it's... I mean, not to be that person, but I mean, who was he hanging out with if it's... I... I don't know. I, I think he probably just wants to go watch movies or play games by himself. I'm not really sure, but hey, at least I ran into you. Um, um would you want to yeah. do something? I was thinking I was just getting some pizza, uh, and I was thinking maybe I could go to the arcade, but it's a lot more fun with more than one person. <laughs> Yeah, um, look, Cassie, really, I'd love to, and I feel bad, because you seem kind of upset. Are you, well, are you sure you're okay? If I'm honest, Gregory, not really. I just have a lot going on and a lot on my mind. Look, um, I, I, I really want to stick around and, you know, hang out and do stuff, but... Um, you I, I'm can't really either? No, I'm, I'm running late right now to go hang out with Circus Baby. She has something really important that she wanted to show me. And uh, look, I was already supposed to be gone, oh my god, 10 minutes ago. And I got held up with a bunch of signings and the meet and greets and stuff with Roxanne. So uh, um, can we talk about this later, please? I, I uh, promise. I, I'm not Gregory, trying to blow you off or anything. I just, um... It's fine, just... Okay, I'll... um, cool. I'll, I'll talk to you later. Um, see ya. Bye. <sighs> I'm 
I mean, I can't expect Gregory just to drop everything and hang out with me, but... Uh, everyone has their own lives, don't get me wrong, even Helpy is just... I just can't help but feel like I'm never anyone's priority. <laughs> oh, things are working out so well, aren't they? <laughs> I can't believe how easy it was to take over Helpy's little AI mind. <laughs> I guess I had the advantage, though, being, well, Vanny after all. It is the Vanny Network. Like taking candy from a baby. <laughs> oh, I am just so excited for these plans to finally be in motion. Oh! There he is. I was just talking about you, Helpy, and how excited I am to work together. <laughs> yeah, um, it's nice to work together as, um, as mm -hmm. well. Um, Did you need something? You look worried. Oh, poor um, baby. <laughs> I kind of did the plan that we talked about, and... I gotta be honest, Fanny, I'm kind of mm -hmm. sad about it. <gasps> sad? Oh, why are you so sad, little Helpy? Tell me, what's going on? Well, I'm just kind of confused. When you told me everything with this plan, you said that this was for Cassie's benefit and it was going to help her a lot. And I know I don't really have any control over what we're allowed to do because you kind of have control of my mind or whatever, but um, I don't know, Helpy just feels really bad because this was supposed to cheer Cassie up and it seems like it's just devastating her. Oh, I think you have me confused for someone who cares, but I guess play the part, Vanny. Um, <clears throat> well, Helpy, you see, I mean, that's part of just, you know, how things work. Wait, you said the deed has been done. Um, I think so. At least Good, but you feel bad about your poor little best friend. Of, of course, uh, she's going to be sad right now. Helpy, what, what was I have paid attention to everything you said? If I'm honest, you're worried because Cassie is what sad. She's sad and. Look, well, that's the thing doing. about being a young little girl, Helpy. She's going to go through different hormones and emotions. It's probably just that. <laughs> no, I don't think it's that, Fanny. But look, as much as you can control my mind and make me do things, Helpy's a very complicated piece of technology. And mm -hmm. I'm still right. going to have my thoughts and feelings in the back of my head. And... Something about this plan just doesn't feel right. Well, why doesn't it feel right, Helpy? I know you have your poor little thoughts and feelings, but maybe you should just cast those aside. Turn them off. You're capable of doing that, right? You know, feelings, they often get in the way of plans and things that we need to do to succeed. And sure, we're going to have things that we don't want to do sometimes, but, um... It's for the best, right? I mean, you want the best for your little Cassie friend, right? Of course I do. I, of I course you do. Because you're such a good friend. But don't forget, you are my friend too now, aren't you, Helpy? We're friends? Yes, of course we're friends. Sure, I'm like the more popular, cooler, prettier friend, but you're still, um, you know, you're like my sidekick. <laughs> and like I was saying, um, you know, this plan, it, it might seem bad or evil and that, you know, face value, sure, it kind of is, but it's really what's best for everyone, you know, even Cassie, she, she's a smart girl, she just unfortunately was dealt a bad hand of cards in life, and um, she's a 
suffering with her emotions or whatever going through it, but you and I, we're going to make everything better for everyone. <laughs> really? Mm-hmm. Everyone indeed. Mainly me, but that's besides the point. Um, <clears throat> so, uh, yeah, I mean, you trust me, don't you, Helpy? I don't think I have a choice. You don't. <laughs> that's the beautiful thing about programming and hacking and everything else. Just move forward with the plan and everything will work out the way it's supposed to. Capiche? Capiche. Alright, All right. well, toodaloo now. I need to watch some productive morning routines on YouTube to get, you know, my productivity levels up. We're manifesting a beautiful 2024, Happy. <gasps> Goodbye. Um, yeah. Uh, uh, dude, uh, yeah, this, uh, yeah, you don't, you don't have to talk anymore. Just do that. Yeah, there. Perfect. <laughs> oh, what an obedient little bear. Anyways, back to what I was doing. <laughs> I just, I tried to play video games, but you know what? I'm just going to go home. Clearly, no one else wants to hang out with me or do anything, so it's fine. I'll just go and... I'll just hang out by myself and everything will be perfectly fine. Cassie! Uh, hi, sweetheart. How are you? Uh, um, <clears throat> hi, Roxy. I'm, I'm good. I was just, um, uh, heading home. Well, is something the matter, dear? Or you seem upset and... Wait, are you crying? Oh, um, <laughs> uh, no, no, I'm, I'm fine. It's, it's nothing, uh, really. <laughs> Cassie, uh, look, dear, y you know you can talk to me about anything, right? I mean, plus, I deal with Gregory trying to do this to me very often, and you know what? Being a mother and everything, I can tell when something's up. What? What is it? <sighs> um, right, I guess you caught me. Um, th this might sound really dramatic, but I don't know. I guess just lately I've felt so alone, you know? I... I feel like I've been so good recently trying to not let my dad's passing affect me, but Christmas really made those wounds fresh again. So uh, I've been trying to lean on those that are closest to me, and I just feel like in doing so, I'm pushing everyone that I love away from me. Oh, sweetheart. Please don't feel like you're a burden to anyone, okay? Anyone. Uh, you know... When my brother passed last year, I, I truly thought my life was over as well. I basically felt like I was drowning every single day. Nothing even made it better, except for having the people I love surrounding me. And you're doing everything right. And you can always call me and talk about this. Plus, I mean, you have Albie and Gregory. They... They adore you, and they would do anything for you as well. You know, I thought so too, but... Maybe I'm just overreacting, but... Elpy has been so... Weird and distant lately. I want him to have his freedom, but... Even when we make plans together, it's... It's like he's not even here. And Gregory... He's just so busy, you know? I know he cares about me, and he would do anything for me, but how am I supposed to just ask him to drop whatever he's doing to comfort me? It's, that's not fair. I'm really sorry to hear about Elby, son. It sounds to me like you need to be having this conversation with him if you well, haven't yet. Gregory, on the other hand, yes, he's busy, but there are a few things in the world he cares about more than you. <laughs> I'm not sure if 
there's anything in the world he would care more about than helping you, just talk to him, okay? Communication is key, after all. <laughs> You're right. Thanks, Roxy. I really needed this today. Um, do you know what? Uh, would you maybe want to go get ice cream or something? I could probably use the company. I'm... <sighs> I'm really sorry, Cassie. I'd love to. I really would. And I don't want to, you know, not go with you considering what you're going through. But I unfortunately have plans tonight that I really can't reschedule. A uh, rain check? Can we plan another time? Uh, yeah. Another time, for, for sure. Don't worry about it, Roxanne. I love you, kiddo. I'll talk to you later, okay? Have a good rest of your night. Yeah, um, you too, Roxanne. <sighs> of course, I can't expect her to drop her plans, too. It's just... Everyone always leaves. Everyone. <laughs> oh, the increased heart rate. <laughs> oh, this is just hilarious. Because he has no idea what's even happening. But more and more each day, she just feels more alone. <laughs> oh, this is just too easy. Soon, night girl will be putty in my hands. Valuable, obedient. Oh, the universe is just handing me wins all day, every day. I couldn't ask for any. Oh, uh, uh, what, what are you doing here? I was in the middle of an evil monologue, you see, and you don't interrupt my evil monologue. Do I have to get lazy to tell you what happens when people interrupt my evil monologue? Anyways, what is it? What do you want? Um. I'm just a little confused. We just had this conversation about how this is supposed to help her and everything, but um, it kind of sounds like you're excited about the fact that Cassie is upset. Um, can you just maybe help Cassie understand? Help, help me. Un you want me to help you understand? You are a little bag of emotions, aren't you? Okay. It's actually really <clears throat> interesting. I've never felt emotions like these before, but. Ever since you put whatever you did to my brain, I right. had a lot of feelings in the back of my head that have been pushing forward, and I still just don't really understand them, but mm. I really want to be able to. I just, I can't wrap my head around how this is actually helping Cassie, Miss Fanny. I see, I see. Uh, well, Helby, <laughs> you don't fully understand your emotions just, you know, yet fully. After all, like you said, they're new to you in the back of your little eye brain. And plus, I mean, I was going over all your little files, and it seems like access to the internet is partially turned off. In yeah, that little Cassie, head of yours? I had to do that a while ago because there was a lot of things I didn't understand. I see. It was like well, overloading my systems. <laughs> lucky for you, your recent new upgrade that Cassie so graciously installed. You can handle a lot more than you think, Helpy. In fact, I think I have a little surprise for you. <laughs> a surprise? What is it? Is it like a birthday party? No, it's not a birthday party. I think it's time for you to understand feelings better, of course. <laughs> here, yes. why don't you enter this little tube over here for me? Are you sure mm. this is a good idea? This is something that Cassie always prohibited us doing because she didn't want to overload my systems and make me, you know, freak out or anything. <laughs> of course it's good, healthy. I mean, plus, don't you want to understand emotions more so you can help your little friend? <laughs> I guess I do want to make sure that Then I get understand. in the tube! Oh, um, okay, I'm getting in the tube. Finally! 
Oh, it's so hard when you just have so many questions and I don't have answers for all of them, Healthy. I mean, I have answers I can give you, but you know what? Getting into it, I think this is going to make you feel so much better. <laughs> don't worry, Healthy. It'll all be over soon. And it's only going to hurt, well, a lot. <laughs> Let me just power on the machine and enjoy your little electrifying spa day, Helpy. <laughs> or don't. I don't really care. <laughs> you know, I thought AI was supposed to be smart. Healthy is just too easy to manipulate. At the end of the day, of course, I'm helping this stupid girl. Helping her see her true potential. And you, Helpy, you're going to help me achieve it. One way or another. <laughs>